Hey guys, today I will be showing you how to set up and use Band. So let's get started. So we'll go to Band, open it up, and you will see this screen. You can swipe left or right to see these welcome messages, but that's you can just look at that by yourself. First thing we'll want to do is hit sign up right here and you can sign up in three ways. You can use your phone number, you can use Facebook, or you can use your email. Well, I don't want to use my phone number or my Facebook, so I will use my email. So, go ahead and enter your email address here. Alright, so after you enter your email address, you will enter in your name. So, I'd prefer it if you guys use your class clash names or anything similar to your clash name. So my clash name is Troll King. So I will do Troll and then King. After you do that, go ahead and hit the Agree to Terms and Services and then hit Get Started. Alright, once you do that, you will have to set up your password. So give me a second to set up my password. It gives you exam how or it, it shows you how to set up your password. You have to have it at least six letters long and then have a number in it. So just give me a second here. Once you do that, you will hit OK and then it will bring you to this screen. Once you get to this screen, you must check your email. You can check your email on your phone and once you do that, you will open up that email that is sent by band.us and you will click verify email after you do that if you do it on your phone it should redirect you to this app and you will be able to continue so give me a second and i will be right back so once you verify your email you just click yes i have verified my email or it should just bring you to the next screen if you checked it on your phone so once you get to this screen you will be setting up your profile you do not have to set in your real information. I repeat, you do not need to do any personal information. So for my date of birth, I'll just do January 1st, 1990. I, would, I was not born in 1990, but I'll do it because it doesn't really matter. For your gender, you do not have to set that. You can just exit out at the top left if you'd like, but I will set it because I want to. All right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a screenshot that has TK on it. So... I'm making a note that says TK because those are the initials for my clash name and I will be screenshotting it right now. So there we go, we have a screenshot of that. All right, so let's go back to band, click on our profile, select photo, screenshots, let's click on that screenshot that we have and you can see that you can frame it right here. So we will move it over to get that TK and we will shrink it down it will zoom in and you just drag it over like this and you can resize it as necessary. I want this a little bit smaller. Once you get it smaller, you can just bring it over like that. Now I do have the typing line in there, but that's fine. So just click OK and then you can hit Done. You do not need to enter a phone number. Alright, so once you do that, you will be on the main page of Band. So that was step one. Step two is learning how to join Swerve 2 which is our clan chat. All right, so this is the home page of Band. There's a lot of stuff to look at here, which is kind of crazy, but you don't need to know all this information. So, there are five main tabs. There's the home tab, there's a search slash discover tab, there's your activity tab, a chat tab, and more tab where your like profile is. So. We will just go to the Discover tab. You will want to type in Swerve and then two lowercase i's. They could be capital, but you may not be able to find us. Anyway, the two i's are Roman numeral for two. So go ahead and search that. And now you will see that only one band comes up at the moment, and it's the official Swerve 2 clan chat. Go ahead and click on that. You can click Join This Band. After you do that, this will pop up and it asks who you are. You must answer this and answer it honestly. Otherwise, we might think you're spam and you will be rejected from this class, from this chat. So enter in your info. I'll be like, hi, I'm Troll King from 
swerve two. All right, so once you do that, just hit next. You can set your profile. So see, I've got my TK and my Troll King. So you can set it however you want. Please use your clash name just so it's easier for other people to know who you are. And then, or you could just do something really similar to your clash name. And then hit join. Now as you can see down here, it says request completed. You will become a member of this group as soon as somebody accepts. So, just give me a second and I will accept. Right now, we just got accepted into this chat. And as you can see, if we go back to the menu, right here, we have three new notifications. So let's click on our notification tab. Sorry, I clicked on the search tab. Our notification tab right here, our activity, nothing shows up. But you can refresh all of these pages, any of these tabs, by sliding down and it will refresh. All right, so we have a bunch of notifications here. You can see that we just became a member of the Swerve Band, and band members in Swerve are now talking. All right, so we can click on one of those, and it will go to Swerve to the main page. So after you do this, open up the Settings tab, which is right here. You click on that, and you will see these settings. If you click on this cog wheel right here, in the same spot, you can see a bunch of um, a bunch of settings. So right here it says Add Band to Home Screen. This is really cool. If you click on it, it will add it to your home page. So let let me go to my home page and look at that right there. It added a new application icon on my home page. So now, whenever I want to, uh, whenever I want to talk to people on this clan chat, it'll just open me straight up to the forum home. So there we go. Now, as you can notice, this is the main page, and there's some important information posts on this page. So there will be notices up here by the top underneath the search bar and there is a calendar and there is also some important information right here regarding how to use band. So, and then up here we have the calendar and we have albums which is which we don't have any right now because we don't really share photos at the moment. Anyway, I will try and keep this updated as much as I can. This is the this is the group calendar. Um, whoever joins this clan chat will be notified with whatever I put on here and right now I just have um, battle day starting so if you want to be reminded of this like to attack you just click save event you can open it in your calendar and sorry I'm using Android I don't know what it looks like for Apple but it probably will be something similar you just save it to your calendar it'll open up your calendar app and you can just click save up here I already did that so I don't need to do that anymore um We'll go back to the main page. So this is the main page, and then you can see that this is the info that I posted about using the different chat rooms. So chat rooms, if you go back to the main page, it's this little button right here. This little chat bubble. Click on this, and there are two chat rooms. One is called Swerve 2. That one's going to be for general information, and one's called War right here. Use the general one for anything if you want to talk to members or if you just want to, you know, hang out with them. For the war, if you're in war, in a current war in Clash of Clans, and you need help trying to find, figure out how to attack a base, go ahead and talk here. And if you need troops from somebody for war, go ahead and go here and ask for troops. People may not be on Clash all the time, but you can contact them here, and they will be able to uh, donate to you for war. So there are two chat rooms for this Swerve to chat and um so let's say we want to talk to just normal people in Swerve to I can be like how are you guys doing <laughs> all right so I sent that and then other members can um send stuff back sorry about that all right and then if I need war help you c I can come to this this uh, chat room and I can type how do I attack this base and then I can attach any photo video 
any photo from my camera, I can record stuff, I can send a location or a file, or I can send contact information. I want to send a photo of a base that I want to attack. So I'll go to photo, I'll go to, whoops, sorry, I will go to um, this one, and then I will send this photo. And then I'll attach it and it will send. And then I'll send my message. So see, now people can respond on how exactly I can attack this base. Say, I'm, say I don't know how to attack this base because it looks hard to me. I can get information or opinion from other people. Alright, so that's that in a nutshell. Now, some of you guys may not want notifications from everybody in the group. So, you go, all you have to do is you click on this chat icon in this corner. And then for Swerve 2, you can click on this button up here and you can click on chat notifications. You can turn them off, you can enable silent notifications, or you can turn notifications on. I just have them on silent, so I, I don't, I won't be notifi notified with a sound or vibration. I'll just get the notifications, I just won't be alerted. So that might be nice if you don't want every single thing that people are talking about. But I prefer that you guys keep the war ones on so that if somebody needs something as soon as possible, they can get a hold of other members. So these, this one, I have the notifications on. Sorry. Alright. So, I think that's it. That's basically banned in a nutshell. Um... Also, if you kind of want to clean up the app, you just go to the home page. Um, you can view this invite. This is just like popular stuff on band. I don't really want that. You can decline that. If you don't want to see like this one, you just remind me later. You can close these band tips if you want. And then you, it'll just kind of clean it up a little bit. Um, so yeah, this is your activity. And then whatever comes up in your chat rooms will be right here. And then you can just respond to people in either cl clan or either chat room. So I hope that this guy, this helps you guys in um, war. And I hope that most of you guys download it soon.